Pardon me. Would you have any gray poupon? Well, you can do school or you can do drugs, but you really can't do both. Read Dianetics by L. Ron Hubbard, the owner's manual for the human mind. No dates. Damn. He's throwing that fang, dude. That's like the gif of the dancing dog with a dog's wheel in his butt. Yeah. This guy's fucking nuts, dude. Everybody's always like, are you on TRT? He's like, no, I'm not gay. I eat bananas. <laughs> he, like, <laughs> he breaks down his diet. I'm like, this guy's the best. Yeah, like so that this picture. is definitely, that's a basement ceiling. Yeah. yeah. I'm I think to... this is his house basement. Yeah. He has a backyard. Yeah. Because I never see him in his house proper. He's got the yard. He's he's in and he's in the middle of a divorce. He only has the yard in the basement. No, 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 no. no, no, no. He's, That's a sick deal, though. I think this is a this is a guy who's who's spending this portion of his life entirely alone and loving every fucking second of it. Second he's of pussy it. sober. You think? You I think don't he's think pussy, he's, do you think he's pussyless? I think so. No. I bet you he's gotten too much pussy and he's sick of it now. Yeah, I think he retired. No, I think he's back in the pussy game because he got a yeah. divorce. Yeah, you he's think? fully back in the pussy game. Young pussy too because he's he on Instagram. He doesn't have that pussy glow about him though. Yes, yeah. he know. does. Dude. No, he's he's, so, he's, he's literally a, doing flips about it. This is a <laughs> bliss beyond you know. He's transcended pussy. Year old getting pussy. Yeah, yeah, dude, beyond pussy is jamming in the basement <laughs> and no one bothering you. So, no, I don't think that he's searching for pussy per se. But I'm not saying he. I think he just gets. He pussy. takes it as it comes. Yeah, I like that. No one has ever felt as good as this guy. No, I mean. I mean, except for now, have we seen his face? Yeah, <laughs> on his Instagram. I'm sorry. Let me. Can I, can I please start the show? I'm oh, sorry, was... friends. Welcome back to Tim Butterly's show. Uh, you know, I'm gonna. You know, my bad about last week is that well, that's on me. Okay. What'd you do last week? I just I just got out of line. I just I, for the retard video. No, stop, <laughs> stop. No, stop. <laughs> I it's it's the kind of thing where you know I I know what's in my heart and that I I it's not ugly in there and but you know that that's not something that you maybe use to promote your shit and that's a lesson I've learned and going forward let me promise you I'm not gonna that's not all I'm gonna do <laughs> <laughs> let me promise like future guests like I promise dude I won't put out that kind of stuff <laughs> we I can do it, it we can do that stuff but like I'm I've, duh dude that's my bad <laughs> I'm <Yeah>. sorry <laughs> but. Uh, Noah and I are very happy to uh, uh, spend some time with our guest today. Uh, he's, uh, he's hell of a, a guest. A hell, uh, he's a respectable family man. He's got everything <laughs> going in his way. He's making all the right decisions. He's funny as fuck. He's got drywall rotting in the cores of his brain right now. For real. There's hate pumping through his veins <laughs> and making its way to his truck steering wheel. <laughs> Go fucking crazy at your Woo! welding station for Ryan Foster. Yes. Uh, Oh, let's fucking go. All right, the fuck we're is back. good. Thank God. All right, we're so back, bad. man. All right, we're back. I have some videos of my sister I want to show you. <laughs> no, 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 no. As long I'm as kidding. they're not a clip. No, I don't have any videos. It's a coincidence that we're talking, but like I did, I was hoping you could speak on behalf of everyone, <laughs> every, every normal person, but who is related to like a person you know that would take offense to my oh. humor. I want. I, I was just wondering if you would tell me that it's all good and like I, no one's. Dude, really you're mad. gravy, dude. All right, cool. No, you're good. <laughs> That's all I need, to dude. Do, I man. make fun. I mean, my, my whole family. Is clear. You, if you have an autistic person, she's brutal. She's brutalizing my whole family all day, every day. <laughs> so we take jabs at her. We're like, hey, you're getting a little thick. <laughs> Back off the fucking nugs. You're calling her fat. <laughs> I mean, yeah. No, oh, man. Dude, it's so funny because she's like. She has, I have a joke about it, but she's like called my mom fat and my, she, my mom's like, Daniel, what if someone called you fat? And she's like, why would someone call me? Fat? <laughs> and she has like, her confidence is fucking unbelievable. Yeah. It's cool. Like if you showed her that, if I showed her that video that you put out, she would have been like, I, all right, can I have the control of YouTube? I don't give a fuck. Like, <laughs> who makes super soda? <laughs> kind of faggot loser. <laughs> she would be pissed. Dude, I tried to, we tried to give her a uh, stevia. Is that is that what it's called, Steve? It's the healthy soda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, and we like I, I tried everything, and we put it as soon as she put it in the glass, she could see through it. She's like, Nah, she. <laughs> <laughs> I want that shit looking like motor oil. <laughs> She's not having it because once you, once you, it doesn't. <laughs> the flavor, they're all clear. They look like yeah. mineral water or whatever the fuck. Yeah. And she was just pissed, yeah. like furious. You got to put her on I, like soda stream. 
You gotta get it. You yeah. gotta get soda <laughs> with her own soda. She's not gonna do manual labor for soda. <laughs> <laughs> She'll barely walk. My parents have to hide it in the garage, and she won't even walk out to the garage for it. <laughs> no. It's yeah, dude. Yeah, we feet right. get, her feet are gonna get cold. You know. Yeah. <laughs> Diabetes, dog. <laughs> wow, dude. Yeah, she won't. Whoa. We tried the soda. She's steam. hooked on the super soda. That's, <laughs> that's, that's crazy. <laughs> Only Coke, dude. That's it. Hell yeah. Oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and apparently, like her taste buds aren't that great. Like, she can't taste a lot of stuff. She hates, like, burnt food. Me too. Yeah, really? Like, anytime my mom the makes a... talking about? <laughs> if my mom gives her a hamburger, <laughs> she takes off the bun and looks at both sides, and she's like, I... Whoa. Or, like, the rice, she'll, she'll, like, bit... She'll throw out her entire dinner if, like, there's crunchy rice. Like, if the rice mm-hmm. is a little bit overcooked, she's I not having that. Oh, uh, that's... Yeah, okay. That's, that's like the, a texture thing, I guess. Yeah. The texture fixi- mm-hmm. fixation. Yeah, dude. But, no, so... All right, so I'm... As long as I'm good with her. Yeah, you're good, dog. If I'm good with her... We're great. No. All right. Let's thank go. You. Um, you thank you for bringing us um the uh silverback Tarzan. Silverback Tarzan. I this don't know guy. how I don't know how much this guy's gotten around on the internet, but I'm captivated. I was onto this guy before um Liver King. Really? Because he just paces around, but he'll do like push ups on stumps mm-hmm. in his yard when it's raining. I don't know what the fuck is <laughs> on. Who, but. who will? Uh Tarzan? Yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, obviously, he's pretty proud of his physique, physique and uh, his record collection. And it's pretty like, tight. I, he looks I, like a jacked Andy Dick. <laughs> I just can't. I, I I'm I'm living inside the uh, the notion in his head where the first time he was like doing this alone, and it occurred to him like, "Yo, I got, the world has to see this. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go leave my phone up on something. Yeah. Yeah. Get this cooking." Yeah, I'll get a, I'll, I'll get something to actually hold it next week. I'll just lean it against this fucking picture of my <laughs> ex-wife. <laughs> oh, do you, did, they, did he go through a divorce? I'm such a bad yeah. fan. I'm not even on top of his shit. Yeah, he. I, I in one of these, he. I think that was on Instagram. His, where he's talking his about video new about new beginnings. Yeah, that we saw that on there. Well, hold on, it's starting sorry, again. Yeah, yeah, but no, hold on. But let's let's go with uh, maybe a, a, a couple more videos of his shit. Yeah, show him what he's about. Jacked. He probably just decided he was having the best time and he needed to tell people yeah, about it. Like, I'm the fucking man. People should know about <laughs> yeah. this. This is like this is who Sting thinks he is. Yeah, absolutely. That's a good call. This is TRT Sting. Oh my <laughs> god, look at him holding it for who's and recording. Dude, look though? at the drop. Yeah, true. He's got a sidekick with him. He's got someone probably on staff. Who is his Robin? But he's got to be single, right? It's his son here for the weekend. Oh, <laughs> he only puts out content every other weekend. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but he gets a lot in, so we can spread it out. Yeah, he brings so many parachute pants with him. <laughs> every day. He's like, we gotta switch this up. He's a he's a showman. He does this he does this for the general public. Oh, look at him. I love Damn. going out to a street where everyone's clearly hammered and you're dead sober just showing them what's up. Yeah. I can smell that color of sweatpants, by the way. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no matter where, it's like peanut butter, but fucking ass and like a little bit of milk that got spilled on and smells bad now. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't wash them. Those are his lucky pants. <laughs> yeah. I no, do dude. love he has tube socks and Yeezys on. Kanye's probably like, what the fuck? No, Kanye's like, this guy's it. This yeah, is it. Yeah. He's, in. he's gonna be at the next Yeezy fashion show. Dude, that's so hard to do. I know, I and I'm blown I'm away. Blown, yeah, yeah, he has insane like, control. He's gotta be the 50 at least, right? I'd say even What 60. is the end game, though? Maybe, Get as yeah, much pussy like, as possible. <laughs> 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 Fuck a Kardashian. That's what the end game is, dude. <laughs> Do a sex tape with Kim. Uh, yeah, I might have overcomplicated this, but all right. So, is this origin story or is this uh, just like checking in? A few times I've had to start again. Damn the music in the background. Everything breaks apart. You got to go somewhere else and start again. <laughs> you have to go, go to the shed else. and start again. <laughs> you have to move to a new town. <laughs> do new handstands. <laughs> Life's always starting so again. I think so. Is this the lifestyle that he crafted for himself after the bitch left? Yeah, he take the records and bounce. I think that maybe he started doing this and his wife was like, "Yo, what the fuck?" And he's like, "No, this is what I need to do." And then it tore the relationship apart. I was born to do headstands. Yeah, <laughs> this is what I'm here you for. You wouldn't get it. <laughs> maybe because <laughs> he has like a he has a T-shirt from he bought online. It says like it's a headstand <laughs> thing. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> it's all printed upside down. <laughs> <laughs> His hair is permanently hanging like that. He fucking rocks. 
<laughs> I've been on this guy for like a year. <clears throat> uh, I'm, uh, you know, is he is he mostly jolly? Dude, I've never like, seen him negative. That was pretty sad. Except man. pull up his Instagram, he just bashed his face. I need to see what happened. What's, I don't, his, what's his Instagram? Uh, it's Silverback Tarzan. <clears throat> this is honestly blowing my mind too. I've never looked at YouTube or Instagram on a, a computer. <laughs> <laughs> Phone only, dude. Oh, yeah, man. look at his face. Well, you have a real job. Yeah, yeah Damn, true. what happened to him? Migrants. Oh, no. <laughs> That'd migrants. be so funny. He's like, these migrants are getting out of control. They pull up on a boat. And hit my face face first. So now, it's not hanging me off my nose. And waiting for the ambulance. with sand, <laughs> yeah. sand in my eyes. Wait for the ambulance with sand in my eyes. I mend everything. Mends. So you make sure we always play the game. And uh, have a go at doing the things that you think are possible. Sometimes it won't work. Sometimes it will. Where's he? What is that accent? Years, He's worked. British. For He's sure. British, but where? Very occasionally, you have a little bit of a weird one. And today's the weird one. So probably like up, north. Scars for life. Real scars from playing the game. Loads of love. <laughs> Lots of love. That being said, I love. I just love having your better face. than dealing with me ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> it hurts like a bitch. <laughs> I mean, not as big as my. <laughs> tonight, tonight, tonight. I just love your night, first reaction night, to get your face smoked. Just do that. <laughs> yeah. He's like, get yo, my just a heads up. <laughs> I've, uh, I seem to have ground off most of me face. <laughs> uh, <laughs> shout out to my sponsor, <laughs> Autobox. <laughs> Phone works. <laughs> Notice I am recording this on my device. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking rules, dude. Uh, and then he's got those are the worst. That like rug burn scar, because then it turns into booger. It just looks like you have yeah, a booger true, on your face. True, true. Yeah, like booger. Yeah. Look at him, dude. He's got yeah. booger eyes. Last night, I was lying there in the bed, and uh, oh. your loved ones. It looks like a fish around. laid eggs on his eye. Quite, everyone's quite hard and quite strong. I wish you spit this all over. Do you have? Do you have and another one of those? My mouth yeah, brother. Don't realize the sensitivity to someone comes holds your hand and says they love you. And I just want to say, like, if you're on your own doing your thing. It's falling apart. Over there's here. no one there to hold your hand or. Oh, he's you, talking about being divorced. Yeah, I just wanted to know that. Yeah, um, up until now it was pretty sweet. Now that I'm in, <laughs> now that I'm recovering from a pretty cares. serious you traumatic right injury, <laughs> uh, Deborah, <laughs> if you're watching this, <laughs> please, we can make it work. I promise. Some stripper rug burned his cheek up. I just want to send you loads of fucking love because I'm lucky enough to feel some love of some beautiful people. Dude, I love him. He's talking about pussy. Yeah, he is. I do. He's got a line of girls at his hospital. He's at the hospital. Door. He hears yeah, a fucking he <laughs> dude. What un a beast. He's unstoppable. Is he out and about Yo, now? Yo, got me stitches done. <laughs> oh, I'll mess my face today. <laughs> Is he speaking English? The doctor comes. Yo. Yo, got my stitches done. <laughs> God, <laughs> dude. Come on, man. Yo, got me stitches done. <laughs> oh, I'll mess my face today. Oh, get it I off your eyelash. I'm uh, NHS in England and anywhere you got. Uh, healthcare for free and all that sort of thing, or just like the NHS specifically. Hear that, Biden? You fucking people, piece of shit. Uh, <laughs> you don't realise, like, so you're sitting there, you think you ain't got no one. You become ill. You'll see how many fucking people care about you. <laughs> yeah. Really. yeah. Where's the real ones? <laughs> I love that he's like, it take, you, you gotta bash your hand. face, hang yeah. gliding to you find out who cares about you. You, got, you, to help you gotta half kill yourself. <laughs> Smash you your brains like on a rock suffering. on the ground from 16,000 feet. There, you'll have people come and help you. His house is a tight you, color, too. Need that is cool. Or is he in the hospital? Can you say the words? <laughs> real he eyes, like real eyes, <laughs> smashed <laughs> eyes. He looks like he's in a third world country. NHS That's stuff. England for you. There's man. definitely exotic oh, birds in the back of here. One lucky human being. I want to say so much love to Fuck. all the people who look all after people, people who uh, be the nurses, scraped up the bits surgeons. of me face I left on my room. Yeah. Skilled, skilled <laughs> you, people. You really said give it up for first responders. <laughs> have that around us. So I'm actually and, out oh, here banging oh, me pots and pans. Yeah. He's got a thin oh. red line on his scooter now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's the man. Is it from hang gliding? Yeah, that's what I, he, th I thought he got it from like a nasty handstand. <laughs> <laughs> I think he said, I forgot that we watched him hang glide. In the bloody video, he says it was either going to the rocks or going to the sand. I think that's what the rug burn deal is. Yeah, he took the sand. Getting fucking pitted in a hang gliding accident is brutal. I, I mean, I, you're please. at the mercy of the winds, dude. No way. That's what it looks like. Living the dream right now. <laughs> 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 Oh, dude, you can't tell this guy anything. <laughs> yeah, he's the fucking man. This is the sickest dude. 
Is that the LA River? Where the fuck is he? He's no, in England. England. I know, but like, look at it. Like, what's it look? Oh my god, what are we dude! Oh, that's oh a my god! Living the dream right now. Yeah, <laughs> dude, he fucking Please, rocks, dude. Oh, we will run you through his diet too, dude. He does it all. Is it? Was that abortion? With a dial on the nuts and berries. Oh no. <laughs> Look all the berries in there. The fucking piping hot. <laughs> is it nuts and berries? <laughs> it's boiling <laughs> berries. <laughs> Put all the nuts in there and then boil the berries. <laughs> nuts. Look how hot it is. That's what happened to his face. He threw a bowl of berries in his face. Good fats in there. And um, the almonds are good for proteins. Like, look, now he looks like he's in a little girl's room. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> this guy is an enigma. <laughs> I can't look away from this guy. I've been on his ass for like a year now. It's hard to stay... Who you are. This is incredible. I hope I'm not the last Obviously, guy to hear about bro, this. Bro, bro. He has a naked push-up shirt too. Like, <laughs> 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 and that's who you are. But he also well, puts because of all the people. I love old guys who will do like it looks like Snapchat TRT, like lyrics sort of on the picture, and then he puts <laughs> that on Instagram like. Chief. This is the most the somber man on the planet. They. I'm telling you, he's out of cum. All this dude does is pull ups <laughs> and fucking. That's it. And mourn. <laughs> yeah, mourn. He tried to kill. Oh my god. See what Sick, I'm saying? Man. These videos are definitely from my. I met a guy I like this, actually, I think. I met a guy in the Outer Banks. I rented a motorcycle from him. <sighs> That's White Cop Valhalla, dude. Out. Outer Banks. Outer Banks. This guy. Get on with it. Because you can see all the nice things in life. Oh my god, he's, he's so fucking young. Jacked, man. Really hard when I can get jacked. I'm gonna get jacked like that. Well. That's Everyone's sick. We should all do roids. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> let's I'm down. Uh, dude, not the weighted vest in the backyard. Yeah. David Goggins just ruined everybody. This guy, Good look how fucking jacked like David really Goggins, is. dude. David Goggins really doesn't know shit about divorce. <laughs> to blame in life. Oh, your you knees hurt, dude. My heart hurts. <laughs> I'm fucking dying over here. In your imagination, the way no you comments? Look, the perception of the way yeah, like, you look at he must have shut him comments, down. Dude, There's people no don't love him. He said when it, oh, it takes to get into an accident to see who really loves you. For the things that go wrong in your life. Nothing's happened in your life and there's nothing wrong. You're only looking around and perceiving. It's a bit like if there's a lost sheep for instance does he have a poo shiesty on or a mask a shepherd. That's, like that's a mask a I think it's a hoodie uh, under God, his jacket religion. that snaps around the face no wait no Our see the pink and white thing he's got a head oh, bandage on also, also <laughs> dental <laughs> surgery <laughs> for free really by the way me too fake I got it fixed for free <laughs> needed someone to pick me up from the dentist no one kind handstand out front for free I would wait for cabs like that one the toughest shit ever I would uh I'm telling you this guy's been cranking out content for years it's it's I mean, it's been a joy to watch him grow. <laughs> Truly, I I can't I can't believe what I'm seeing. I can't believe. Look, he's on a shopping cart in that one. I can't believe you can do it this big. <laughs> His girl took him out to buy tampons. <laughs> <laughs> Is that Mama? Heavy yeah, flow? Or... He's with someone. Wow, dude, that might just be a stranger. That's a girl he's trying to pick up. Yeah. You want to see something, love? Damn, he's on British and Practical Jokers. <laughs> <laughs> Make her that hot fruit soup you had earlier. <laughs> Nuts and berries. You ever burn your lip on some acai? <laughs> this guy fucking rules. Yeah. Oh, is that him young? i never seen that one. Where? Right there to the left. In the tower. This one? Oh, there. What the hell? Have faith in yourself. He's been jacked. Hey, yes, it is possible. What the hell? I was jacked. Gay. <laughs> <laughs> Gay again. <laughs> Whoa. He's been dedicated to this his entire life. This yeah. is a muscle monk. He lives this shit, dude. Mm. He's in the monastery. Dude, my uncle Dickie went to uh <laughs> he was a monk. I swear to God. My grandma's brother. He was a monk for Do like Do we agree on what the word monk means? No, he was like a Catholic monk. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, or is it a Catholic monk and then he left to marry a black chick? He lives in Florida now. What what does a well, Catholic did. monk he do? I don't know. He just lived in Diddle. the woods in like Maine. Is that different from a priest in Catholicism? He was full on monking. I don't know whether they means. kept monks. Me neither. I he think everybody been... has a monk, right? He was monked out. Or some kind of version of a monk? No? Maybe. No. Are there like Southern Baptist monks? <laughs> Snake monks? Yeah, they're <laughs> bad as hell. <laughs> uh, yeah. yeah, I know he was definitely a monk, and then he married a black chick and bounced to Florida. Well,. This this is the muscle monk dude. He's in yeah. The this temple. is the guy. He's in the temple of gains. 
Wow. This might be it. This is the new this is this the is, new role model. This is my Joe Rogan. Wes Watson is dead to me. <laughs> it's silverback. He's been getting heat. I just seen. Do you ever follow? Yeah. There's like a page. Wes Watson. He's the fucking. Oh, he's been called out as he's a, the wood pile guy for right? a long time. He's the ra- he was the Aryan Brotherhood guy. He's skinhead. Ex-con. Yeah. But now he but, just walks but, around mansions and he's he like, has no hate in his heart. He was you're just a skinhead by fact. Yeah. You're in prison. Dude. De facto skinhead. He's just the one that's honest about it. You know. Yeah, and he'll like drive around Bugattis. He's like, you guys aren't on the yeah. phone early enough, or whatever the fuck those guys <laughs> say. Wait, what's he getting? Cold for? calling. I just <laughs> there's he like make a, fun of Down syndrome people. I wish. Oh. That'd be so funny if you had him on here. <laughs> What's with the soda? You and me, man. <laughs> Guys like us used to be allowed to make jokes, right, buddy? <laughs> you wouldn't be retarded if you didn't have burpees. <laughs> but, uh, no, there's some guy who, like, exposes all the fucking hustle people on Instagram. And apparently, like, he, like, owed a bunch of money on the house he owned. Like, he, like, he shoots videos in a house he rented or something. Yeah. It's like an Airbnb. Ooh. I love how people are shocked by that shit, though. I'm like, yeah, this guy's not a business expert. Yeah. <laughs> like, he does it. seem kind of stupid when he talks. Yeah. It's like but, out. I thought that if you were just that jacked and confident, then it's like, whatever the third thing you need is, is it, it's, yeah. it's, it's overcome. <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. True. If you can get that jacked and... I, don't you wish you could rock a bald head? Do you think? My, do I wish my head was a different shape? Yes, that's what I'm. That's, that's what, I, what you're asking. I, that's yeah. how I feel. I think yeah. you'd have a fine bald head. No, I don't think so. I have Neanderthal <laughs> uh, DNA. Can you I feel can like? Me, can can I see? It. Can you turn? I feel like me and you have similar head shapes. I don't know. I think it, it it's kind of blocky, but I think it's fine. Yeah, dude, I've got high corners. That's my problem. Those, Those are Polish rounders. heads. Mm. Yeah, like yeah, I'm very no, blocky. I'm Irish. Like Irish pole, it's all the same dirt. Yeah, all those, all those uh, filthy blooded potato losers. eating fucking sexy shit. Mm-hmm. But you know, what was the other retarded thing we were watching? Um, I don't know, man. I got pretty high and I got lost. <laughs> uh, I, but uh, we talked soda. We talked Tarzan. Who uh, did you guys watch? We were, the watching, women's, we were watching did, Joe Coy uh, bomb. Oh uh, yeah, it was tight. dancing competition. Did you guys watch the NCAA women's college national championship? No, <laughs> I heard about it. I'm just so sick of guys talking about it. No, everybody think it's so I good. I, you what's know the, what's the gist? I found out about that lady that was apparently really good at basketball during March Caitlin Madness. Caitlin Clark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a there's a white chick, Caitlin Clark, who's like the Larry Bird of ladies, apparently right now. And there was uh, Angel Reese, who was the black chick on LSU. Oh, so you mean the last really great white player? But, dude, <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is our fucking... She's the chosen one. But she is heinous. But Antonio Brown, the NFL player with CTE, keeps saying she looks like Mel Gibson. It's the funniest shit. <laughs> I mean, he no, like, no. He, I know, but he's just... Dude, he's fucking retarded. <laughs> and he posts he, pictures. He posts her with She like, looks like a <laughs> horrifically realistic Mona Lisa. Yeah. She has, she Damn, has that's the a Gib- good call. She has the yeah. Gibson forehead, though. That's the thing. What's the Gibson forehead? A big forehead. Oh. Bit, very prominent. Very expressive forehead, you know? Mm-hmm. Probably crinkles that shit up a lot. Hell. He hates Jews. It looks smooth. Okay, so she's catching heat. She's fucking... No, she no, was she, crushing it. She beat the black chick who was like, I'm a sassy queen. And then she was in like Sports Illustrated, and then the black chick lost, and she's like, I've been sexualized. There's just so much... If you oh, get into that no. whole Twitter, it's so funny. Oh, no. But I was like, but she just lost today, so I was like, I would love to hear the N-word count today <laughs> throughout <laughs> the Midwest <laughs> and the South, dude, because they lost. Dude, to, if we could capture that, like, uh, metropolis energy. Yeah, like, you like could power the screams. country. <laughs> like, Chernobyl-level energy. It's yeah, dirty. Yeah, it was good. I mean, I thought it was funny. Because <laughs> there's so many dudes I know that are like, dude, I'm loving ladies' basketball. I'm like, no, you're not. Isn't that crazy to see? Yeah, I've I've seen wild. some earnest women's basketball loving, and I'm just like, yeah. you seriously have room in your life Turn for women's basketball? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not even saying anything about women's basketball. I'm just like, dude, that's that's within your periphery. That's crazy yeah. to me. I need man. to see these layups, brother. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you're at like, uh, let's say you're, let's say you have a family, and you're like, babe, I need 90 minutes to myself today. I'm watching women's basketball. It's like, yeah. bro, come on, <laughs> I say that, and I go watch fucking Silverback Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> I need some time to watch handstands. <laughs> My boy just took a hang gliding accident. Fuck that, dude. I put it on the TV in the living room while we're eating dinner. I'll be like, yeah, Yo, you guys got to see you this. like this? Look yeah. at that. He's perpendicular. <laughs> the amount of times I make my girlfriend watch old UFC fights, she can't take it anymore. 
Yeah. I teared up when Korean Zombie retired. <laughs> I was like nine beers deep. I'm like, you don't get it, you fucking bitch. She's fucking eight months pregnant. <laughs> yeah, that's no. been how I'm living right now. Oh, uh, MJ's really great to watch MMA with. She'll she'll always hit me with it. Is this that one guy? And like, almost, almost, almost. And I'm just like, yeah. My girl's like, getting there. She thinks everyone's Luke Rockhold. The worst mistake I ever did was show Luke awesome. Rockhold. Don't show like, your girl Luke Rockhold. Man. <laughs> yeah, we need to put it. him in the vault, man. Yeah. He's coming Push out. out you the you can show forever. him uh, post bare knuckle boxing. True, that's the best version. The well, he's about yeah. to fight Joe Schilling. See that idiot? They're fighting in karate combat. Yeah, yeah. Luke Rockhold, dude. Well, Good I need Lord. a really handsome picture of him. Now, this is this like, let's say, <laughs> can we get hard to this? <laughs> now, <laughs> I'm I'm saying most handsome. Uh, you know, most most object uh, like, what, what would you say? He's traditionally uh, handsome. Yeah, he's very handsome. classically handsome. The, but, yeah, the, the, he's a fucking Ralph Lauren model. Mm-hmm. Really, like in real life. Yeah. Damn. But he was on a Millionaire Matchmaker. Did you ever see that? Mm-mm. He was. I'm pretty sure he got kicked off Millionaire Ma- Matchmaker. He was like. All, with like a live mic on the first date, he's like, "Do you swallow?" I was like, "Boss, yeah. <laughs> you can't, beast, yeah." You can't, you can't hate on a guy like well, that. If you're if you look like that, I guess it you really do you do get to throw yeah. that kind of thing around. Like he probably pushes women into the wall and kisses them, and they go, "Yes, yes this is sick." <laughs> Carries Thank around God. fucking shot glasses of cum. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, he's definitely been slapped for saying something rude to a woman and then kissed her while holding her wrists. And oh, absolutely, yeah, Again, against the brick wall. <laughs> Roll it out. <laughs> yeah, <dude. laughs> big, big. yeah, I mean, yeah. he's yeah, the man. Imagine. Wait, why are we talking about how hot he is? How, how do we get there? Ah, we just got gay out of nowhere. We, How'd that happen? No. <laughs> you showed. Oh yeah, you showed your girl. Silverback Tarzan. No, oh, yeah. women are dumb. That's how it started. <laughs> <laughs> it ended up with me being gay. Yeah, what a mistake, man. No, but, yeah, she's been watching UFC now, and she's like getting into it. She's starting to pull together. Uh, but. Um, the, but then you got to show her Luke Rockhold's tooth. Dude, uh, he fought. He fought maybe the goat wigger. Mike Perry's the wig. Yeah, he is. He's the Bret Hart of wiggers. <laughs> yeah, and then you show your girl fucking this shit. Yeah, but like, come on, dog. Or that. And then she goes, oh, my God, was he okay? Nah. Worst, yeah. Remember when he fought, what's his face? Um, Paulo Costa. Almost making out with him with the blood. Did you, did you watch that fight? Yeah. yeah it's tough. All that gay shit. Yeah, probably Mike Perry fucked. Yeah, I love Mike Perry, dude. Is, Bro, I, I mean, hate foo foo shit. This is, we <laughs> can't <laughs> talk about that. You know, look at this. <laughs> <laughs> look at this picture. Dude. The best. <laughs> dude, did you ever see the did you ever see the video? Can you imagine, dude. The, the saturation's so high. Imagine if you oh. could jam a straw into this photograph and suck out that feeling. <laughs> <laughs> God oh damn, my God. dude. I would blow up a gas station if I felt like that. <laughs> <laughs> Allah, walk up. Fuck yeah. Oof. Did you ever see the video of Mike Perry's, like, he started the insurance company sketch? Did you ever see that? No. Oh, my God. What does he, what's he say? Just look up, look up Mike Perry uh, insurance or something. I forget what he says for retired fighters. It's so funny. This is the one where, like, Tyrone Woodley was like, he's allowed to say it. <laughs> he's hitting a, a punching bag, um, or maybe retire. Look up ret- Mike Perry, retired fighters. I forget how he says it. It's so funny. Retired fighters sounds all from the truth and sound. No, maybe he said just Mike Perry says N word. Then <laughs> I'm gonna give it. A, I'm gonna give it away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In video. Click um, he's like hitting should, a punch bag. He's like, it's a uh, Perry's insurance for <laughs> retire for it. Is it this? Uh, Mike Perry so, is an impression. I mean, he man. probably let it rip on this one too, <laughs> but what he says. blackest man in the UFC. <laughs> the DNA test and the results came back French and German, British and Irish, and I was two percent African. So I am legally allowed to say the word Shabbat Shalom, boy. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah. dude, he's hitting it. Wow, he's great like, meme. Mike Perry, I started insurance for a bitch ass N words who can't fight no more. God Ooh. damn it. It's so funny. God damn it. I don't know where it is. God damn it, dude. Sorry, failure to bring up. I'll show them this. I'll show them that sometimes I hit a dead end searching, and sometimes I, it's definitely because I'm too stoned to really turn on the air. Turn on the jets. Yeah, yeah, yeah dude. Really I gotta hit the, the autism NOS to get yeah, ready dude. to go. I, I'm drifting away. My connection to uh, technology is just failing me, man. Dude, I have no connection to technology. I don't know how people live like that. 
I can connect to hi hats. I put on some hi hats in my kitchen today. That's what I got going on. What's a hi hat? Like hi hat lights, like uh, the round lights in your ceiling. You put your lights on the Wi Fi. No, no. Oh, just electric. Electric. I'm not into that, oh, dude. Okay, yeah. Fucking okay. old school. <laughs> <laughs> I want hard connections. I like, like regular blue, light. No Bluetooth that makes me gay. No, I got a baby. Do you, yeah. do you just walk around being in it, being a, a, a modern uh, craftsman? Do you walk around like these modern houses and just call all of the amenities <sighs> gay, brother? No, literally, I, I've been. I got hooked up with a gang of gay guys who have these nice ass houses, and they call me to fix shit, and you can just charge them whatever. How did you but, infiltrate this group? Uh, a lesbian, or I think she's bi. That you would know. Please get this right. I won't leak her. <laughs> <laughs> this dumb dyke <laughs> is friends with, uh, <laughs> she, she hit me up with this guy. was like, I own a bunch, I guess like him and all. As soon as, if, whenever I do get hooked up with a side job and you walk in, you see gay guys on the house, you're like, jackpot, brother. Mm. Cause these guys and they just go, Ooh, is that expensive? Yeah, they're blown away that you can cut sheetrock. <laughs> they think it's like fucking steel. How are you doing that? <laughs> gay guys have never punched through drywall. So if you make a hole in that shit, they're like, they think you're a fucking wizard. It's nuts. I was like, I'll put it now. Like, right, wherever the fuck you want it, dog. Point. <laughs> <laughs> Point and shoot, dude. Where you want to charge these dildos at or whatever the fuck you guys are into. <laughs> you want a bidet in the kitchen? Done deal. <laughs> Easy. I fucking... <laughs> that's all they want. Them dudes love bidets. Uh, yeah, me too. But uh, do you have a bidet? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I got a bidet. It's in the first floor. I got to fix it. No, you can't use it. You can't crap in the first floor. <laughs> oh, I can't ruin dude. a birthday party. I shit while I watch UFC. <laughs> I can see it from the corner. It's oh. the best. <laughs> Me and my no, girl dude. just reached the point where we can shit around each other. Oh, well, yeah. That's love. You probably saw her blast one while she was giving birth. Dude, a C-section was the best. Oh, okay. It was. She was oh, so no. pissed well, about Did the... you see her fucking organs and shit? Oh, yeah. Oh, they okay. were like, you don't have to look. I'm like, let me see them. You gotta yeah, look. Shit. Yeah, I like that. They, they had them in like the little dishes. They had so them sick. in dishes? That's yeah. crazy. Did you poke they, it? You poke her lungs? I wish. See if she could still breathe. I, was I would have picked it up and said, how long do I microwave this? <laughs> <laughs> I just <laughs> ah, psyched out. Uh, <laughs> no, they had uh, our nurse for the C-section. We had a lazy-eyed Mexican gay guy. Let's go! The Holy, the holy Trinity, That's dude. That's a shiny Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> and uh, he took us. He was taking her back. Like, you have to sign. I guess they took her back, and I thought they were making her sign waivers, but they were literally starting the shit. So when I got back there, he was like, I'm going to play jams for you. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Y'all ready and for it, this? <laughs> 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 no, worse. They were playing Drake, and my girl fucking hates Drake. No. I was dying. She's like whacked on the lawn. Race thing or just the music? Just the music. <laughs> okay. You would think. She likes Drake Cole <laughs> for whatever that's worth. <laughs> but she was just fucking pissed, like whacked, looking around, like, turn this off. Oh, and she's was on just, fucking oh, morphine. Yeah, so funny. yeah. She uh, was flying. He's holding her and Tessa going, this is my hell. favorite song. Oh, <laughs> way too many people here, right? <laughs> it was crazy. I ain't no way, Nate. I like me. Oh, <laughs> you know, you really do <laughs> hear fucking organs squishing <laughs> around. <laughs> Some guys beatboxing. That guy only mean one thing. <laughs> Dude, it was crazy. YOLO, that's true, you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, that was a good time. But, oh, dude, she can't speak to say turn it down. That's hell. She went yeah, to hell, man. I was laughing. Because <laughs> they gave me my phone and they're like, take pictures. And I'm just like, fuck <laughs> I was <laughs> taking it in. <laughs> 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 well, dude, do you remember? You had a daughter. You have a daughter, right? Yeah. When they took, when the baby first comes out, her pussy was swollen. Do you remember this? Her vagina. The they babies? Were like, yeah, the babies. <laughs> they were like, dude, I'm counting fingers. They were like, her fingers and toes are good. I'm like, cool. What's up with her snacks? <laughs> dude, it was fucking huge. And they were like, oh, it's like the Might hormones. Got stuck on something. <laughs> <laughs> are you sucking on that guy? <laughs> and the <laughs> baby's just horned up. I love orgies, dude. He's What's like, going on? He spanked the wrong side when she was upside down. He's fucking thumping, dude. <laughs> No, yeah, they were like her. Doctor, why is my daughter's <laughs> pussy so juicy? <laughs> What's that whap my daughter has? This is crazy. <laughs> I can't wait for it. You went for the retard clip to this. <laughs> it's a fat newborn pussy. This oh, is crazy. Man. No, but they were like, yeah, apparently, like, I guess, like, ba boys' nut sacks are huge, and then the girls' pussy swollen from, like, the <laughs> hormones. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay. Ooh, oh, yeah. hormones, Babies are born with fat hormones, nuts and say. fat pussies. <laughs> <laughs> That's my stepdad's favorite joke. How do you make a hormone? 
kick her in the stomach. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I heard that like 4,000 times a week. <laughs> yeah, up. like second grade. <laughs> yeah. You're saying it to other children. A heater, <laughs> You're saying it to other nine-year-olds. Like a hormone. I'm like, like a what? Hormone. You know a whore? You know like hormones. No. You know. Your whore. mother. What's moaning? And you go, I don't know. Yeah. I don't have time to explain it, brother. Whores do, though. Your you dad know, doesn't okay. let you watch cool movies? <laughs> Fuck. Jesus Christ. Who are you painting? I'm well right now. I'm painting. <laughs> I'm painting the guy. I'm painting the. Oh, that's what I was saying. Uh, it looks like painting Tarzan. Is that guy's name? Th what's a the Sith guy? What? That's kind of Count Dooku. Like. Is that Star Wars? He looks like Count Dooku. Is that what you're saying? The red face man. Darth Maul. Darth Maul. Darth Maul. No, this isn't Darth Maul. This is him. This is going to be him after a <laughs> tragic accident. Oh, of, <laughs> that's Darth Tarzan. Speaking dude. of Darth Maul, I don't think that we've. Co so Danny was saying, and I want to know. I want to know if you guys know, and if any of you know about this. Danny said that tar uh, Silverback Tarzan kind of has a wetsuit guy vibe. Are you familiar with wetsuit guy? I've definitely heard it. It's a Philly local thing. Yes. Yeah. I got it confused know. with, do you remember when the guy shot his wife with the harpoon gun? Do you remember that? I feel like I remember that. No? It was right by, you know, Penny Gardens in the Northeast? Yeah. Right by Home Circle. Some yeah. guy used to come into our jujitsu gym talking shit, and apparently the night after he got kicked out, he shot his wife with a fucking harpoon gun. Whoa. Yeah, crazy stuff. Damn, you think he was scuba licensed? <laughs> no. No? So, dude, I didn't know harpoon. I guess the harpoon gun, obviously. I was about to say, I didn't they think they can't trace it, the dude. <laughs> yeah, you off the serial number. <laughs> <laughs> this harpoon gun's filed. <laughs> Damn. Well, wait, wetsuit guy. Wetsuit guy. Rob, do you know wetsuit guy? The wetsuit guy? The wetsuit wet guy. guy. <laughs> no clue. No clue. I, okay. I thought you meant like a fucking like surfer, bro. Um, Wetsuit Guy did kind of look like a surfer, bro. I don't know if we're going to be able to find anything on him online. Wetsuit Guy was a look, and I have mentioned him I, I've in passing. Tried, I've tried to look him up. It's We haven't tough. covered him on this show, have we? No. Uh, was this like the 2010 11? Yeah. He was a around little bit yeah. before that. Like I was in high school, 2007, I, 8, 9, something yeah, like that. Early 2000s was. Uh, uh, he, he was like, kind of like a, um, uh, let me see. Oh man. He had a bunch of aliases. So this was a guy real quick while I, while I try to find any reference to this dude, cause he did end up having, there, there are articles you can find. But that guy was this kind of like phantom who would just be hanging around area shopping malls. And there was a pretty rich shopping mall scene in the early 2000s. I miss a good shopping mall, dude. In, I mean, it's a, it's a bygone era. Yeah, it's get gone. me in a Clover's, it's dude. Come it's on, gone, man. There, it's, it's not coming back, man. I'm sorry. But this dude, no matter what mall you went to, be it Cherry Hill Mall, Franklin Mills, Neshaminy, uh, Moorestown even, I Also would, say. would hit the boards. You hear the boardwalk? Ooh. Oh, yeah. That's cursed, man. That's like Freddy Krueger waking up in the real world. Mortgage you know Pier, I mean? dude. Come on, son. <laughs> but he would just be kicking around in, like, the food court, and he he looked like... Um, I do have a video game character I can look at. To he was in a full wetsuit. I never laid eyes on him. I remember hearing this. He kind of. Well, I think it was a rash guard. Danny, tell me tell oh. me if he kind of It was like John Donner <laughs> just fucking chilling. Oh, come on. Give me it. Tell me he kind of looked like this guy. <laughs> was imagine he a black this guy, guy? Imagine this guy wearing an Under Armour or a rash, any kind of rash guard top. The, typically, it would be like maybe a white one with like a uh, black trim around the neck and wrists. And this is way and, before compression yeah, shirts. Yeah, there was and, no, yeah, and yeah. this was his head and some weird footwear, honestly. Maybe a boot with shorts. You know what I mean? Booted out. But he kind of looked like this guy, in my memory anyway. And... um. You, he would always be either alone or looking like he was bothering a passerby. And everyone got really bad vibes from him. What is he? Also, and, a lot of headphones. Like, really big headphones would just, like, walk Before beats. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, he also oftentimes wore a clock on a necklace around his neck. Yep. I was, am, I, am I missing that? And uh, always with a smoothie or, in his hand. Or a giant watch. Every or a giant a watch, yeah. Big old watch. Yeah, big time piece. <laughs> and, <laughs> and he uh uh just a total freak and you would go and you would see him out in public and you would report back to your buddies and you you'd say Do you we know, got a picture of this guy? Uh he's like the Jersey Devil, there's no like 
Oh, man, I don't know why I Googled wetsuit guy. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he showed a black guy in a wetsuit. Like, okay. Yeah, right, dude. Get real. <laughs> you surfing, chief? <laughs> yeah, uh, you going to fucking water So, <laughs> okay, so the reason, I think we ended up finding out his name, and oh, don't don't show my Googling. He... <sighs> Phantom... He one of his aliases was Phantom Flan, Phantom Flan. Uh, but I don't know. How I'm to so blind I cannot it, read. Dude. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. He was arrested. Okay, so you look at this guy and you. I'll, I'll get to it. Uh, yeah. I'm going. I'm going to get there. But you would look at this guy and your assumption would be this guy's a fucking f- at, at least a creep, definitely a freak. Yeah. Always alone at the mall. Bull and nasty. Big. You know, he's in the food court, dude. He's scoping. He can't the eat Panda teams. Express in a fucking wetsuit, dude. Yeah. Not good. So. You you were always on edge rent. like a, the room got like two degrees colder when you would spot him. Yeah, and you'd laugh and you go, "Ah, fucking wet suit guys here," but then you'd also be like, <sighs> yeah. "You know, you had to sound cool, and then you're like, oh, I'm yeah. fucking actually petrified." <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah like, what if that guy carries a gun and he <laughs> whose mom has snap. the minivan? <laughs> Get her on the fucking horn. But then, so you know, so then you know, you, you assume that you're just making it. You know, later on, you you come to your senses. You go, oh, "I'm just making." This I was up. managing this. It's kind imagining. of a weird guy. Yeah, yeah. but. He ends up getting arrested for uh, he was he lied on a job application for a census worker. What? Yes, he lied on his job application to be a census worker, and that's like a federal crime. What? Yeah, hold on. What did he lie uh, about? Um. Uh. It. Uh, yeah, I wear a shirt and tie every there day. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. <laughs> New Jersey mom recognizes census worker as sex offender. Oh, you dirty dog! Yeah, I mean, dude. New Jersey moms, I've I've been saying this for years. They're hotter than PA moms. <laughs> <laughs> they got solid WAP milfs over there. So he's going door to door in New Jersey. Uh, a man with a U.S. Census badge knocked on Amy Schmalbach's door on May fourth, thinking that answering the door to a government she worker was a safe bet. She did, and then she wondered why he looked so familiar. <laughs> and so I, I guess. I guess if we would have known this guy's name, we could have found him on a sex offender registry, but we didn't. And But this lady, I think, had already seen him in passing on the sex offender registry, and he showed up on her Damn, door. She was just cruising the registry? Uh, that's mom stuff, dude. That's we a were, good mom. We did this today. We were at my sister's house for brunch today, and we we were just... just everyone cruising. checked real quick. Everyone Having a bit of yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Checking out the diddlers? Yeah, mimosa, and look at your phone. <laughs> yeah, I got a rapist on my street. Yeah. I got a rapist 20 <laughs> addresses away from me, so 10 houses down. What? Yeah, and it's, by the way, it's from like 2018. It's not like it's from the 90s and he's suspended. So practicing? This is a real guy <laughs> who Fuck. raped someone in two, or was convicted in 2018. Why is he out? There's so many. Dude, they let them out, man. It's like three Are you years. serious? Four years. They're everywhere. I assumed that was like... You'd think, but they don't care. Dude, well, that's, don't, that's a whole can of worms I don't even want to open. <laughs> <laughs> that's a can of soda I'm not going to crack, dude. Uh, here we go. Um, give me, give me, give me the aliases though. But then, yeah. So then we looked up. Uh, what see. year is this? When the court? This was like 2010. Yeah, 2010. It says, um, Jamie Shepard. I think was the name. That's his name. Yeah. So I guess it was a fake name. He Boy, passed Jamie, a background no check. Um, and yeah, he basically did everything we assumed. I think it was all just like, you know, texting teens. Fingering? Yeah. No good. Yeah. And so I wonder what he's up to. It would be fun to try to track him down. Have I mean, him on the cast. We, he's a fucking Philadelphia, South Jersey cryptid. <laughs> <laughs> can we look him up on the registry? Can you just like search individuals? Yeah. Give me, if you give me a second. Um, yeah. There, there was time. like a, a fucking second. There was like a local like music scene message board. Assaulting an underage girl. Wow. And everyone would like share stories on or all report. The, on all the hardcore message boards, like uh, PA Hardcore, Bridge Nine, Center, like everyone. This was like a, a guy that everyone. Oh, he knew. was like widely known. Yeah. I remember hearing about the wetsuit guy, but I never like got into what the fuck yeah, it was. Yeah, it was this guy. And I wonder if this is a link to him on the registry. Oh, fuck. It's like they took reach. it down. Damn, dude. Wow. Interesting. He had his hmm. records cleaned. Hmm. I wonder who his clients were. Um, There's so many fucking pedos in this neighborhood. They're all over the place. Yeah. Well, don't forget, most of the people around here are inbred and yeah. lead poisoned. That's you know what I was saying. I mean, so it's like, 
Port Richmond, Kensington, mm-hmm. West Virginia levels. Of it really is. It man. truly is. The, the the ground, the air, and and everything they see around them is poisoned. They're getting hepatitis from the sidewalk. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a tough look. So it's like I got vicious fucking fiend neighbors. I get in fights with like nonstop. Her like daughter will come and live in the car across the street for like three days. She's like, "What? It's a nice day." Like you've been fucking sleeping in that fucking. It's viewer. fun. I feel like I'm camping. Yeah. Right. I, I keep telling her she got fat in rehab. She's getting so mad. She's like, you can't tell him I'm clean. I'm like, yeah, Katie looks huge. Yeah, yeah you gained yeah, fat as twenty five pounds. <laughs> yeah. Frozen treats on the bus. Uh, <laughs> been eating uncrustables in rehab. <laughs> fucking bitch. Yeah. I don't know how to. Uh, I don't know how to find. You can't hyper so, him. Okay. I found the. I found an article about the arrest. Uh, if you look up like his real name, there's a Inquirer article, and he went th- he went through online at aliases. Phantom. There he is. <gasps> yep. Thank you. Wet hair too. Wet hair in a mugshot. Did, I think, did I kind of nail it though? Yeah. You know what I mean? Now imagine him with the same accessories, yeah, yeah. with the same with the same uh, you know kind of soul patchy chin beard, and, and when the hair would dry, shades. it would kind of go out I like that. Yeah. Place. He yeah. had wet hair in this. Yeah, he was definitely banging a kid, probably. Yeah, <sighs> seriously. He's definitely showering with a teen. He's forty seven. Now he was pretty he good. Arrested. Oh, so he's much older now. Toot Flynn. <laughs> Phantom Flam. <laughs> what was it? Toot Flynn? Yeah, she remembered his many ali- aliases, including some outrageous ones, such as Phantom Flam, Toot Flynn, and Jamie Shepard. <sighs> Toot Flynn is a tight name. That's sick, yeah. <laughs> Toot Flynn. <laughs> That's a rap battle of a rapper. <laughs> it's like a harmonica player stage name. Dude, I'm not mad at that, dude. Toot Flynn. Yeah, from Mississippi in the 20s. <laughs> they didn't like black people, but he was too good. To he got to play at a white church one oh time. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. What the hell is his real name? Frank J. Co- Cooney? Hmm? Cooney sounds like a weird foreign sexual term. Coon. Yeah, I mean... You're trying to touch my coon. Did you watch the Disney, uh, the Disney I, station? I, I watched the first one. I thought it was kind of a waste of time. Yeah, I only saw clips of it, and I was like, I don't know. It feels like that. that remember that documentary they did the Playboy behind like what happens in Playboy? And I'm like, yeah, yeah no shit. Yeah, I, like, what do yeah, you think? I guess, happened there? I guess maybe it's all. Maybe it is bad, but like. I guess I kind of already knew. It's not showing me anything that I didn't know by assumption and intuition. Like, if I drop my kid off to work a day at Nickelodeon, I'm like, they're getting fingered. (laughs) Like, what are they here? Like, what are these? You want to cross the bridge, you got to pay the toll. (laughs) Yeah, I'm like, meeting a cast director for Nickelodeon, I'm like, yeah, this guy's a fucking pedophile. Mm, Yeah. I I think kids think this is funny. Dude, the whole first episode, they were just like, you're waiting for the pedophile stuff, and they're just like, he was such a fucking jerk. Oh, we yelled at him okay, for being okay. late and shit. Is that yeah, what was going on? Pretty much, man. The big fat, they, and then they just kept calling the one guy fat. I'm like, what? Yeah. You know, what else, dude? Can't call ladies fat, but he can't. You know, uh, <laughs> wow. Uh, a children's, <laughs> a children's TV visionary. Uh, <laughs> That's not. But wow, yeah, guy who really <laughs> tried to deliver on some lofty goals. The Rick Rubin of Nickelodeon. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bitch. Yeah, I guess Nick he is Rubin. just fat. <laughs> <laughs> Hamburger. Hamburger. Ham. That dude is the best. Yeah, Hamburger ain't having that. We watched a lot of. A lot oh of my god. Well, yeah, so that's my pedophile guy. Don't show your crumb. Look at this. Uh, what, the, what are we doing? The breadcrumb bread 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 trail is nuts. <laughs> and then we got Footloose. Really crazy. crazy. Toeless lady. Yeah. <laughs> I have something in my eye. Your eyeball. <laughs> do, you, do you still have the spicy eye drops? Yeah, I'm actually going to go grab them right now. Do you want me to blow in your eye? No, hold on. Give me one. Okay. Put paint in his eye, dude. Whatever, dude. Are you actually classically trained as a painter? Well, no, I just paint myself. Like I paint. You just taught yourself this? Yeah. I won a painting competition when I was in like fifth grade. Really? I painted a sunset still hanging at my grandma's house. Shout out Maureen. You have yeah. a picture of it? Um, Probably somewhere, but I, I'll get it. I'll, I'll track it down. I'll send it in. Oh, yeah. I'd love to see it. I'll send that shit in. What have you, are you into any retarded guys on the internet? What's your thing, though? Mm. I barely know you. I don't know. I, I, I guess I don't get into a lot of retarded guys on the internet. No, no, that's I, like my whole thing. I like like siding salesmen who are in like their wives' minivan. <laughs> tell you need to hustle. I feel like I'm. I get a lot of. Uh, recently, I've been getting a lot. There's this random like. Uh, 
this like Arab game where there's a big table and they have these like little discs and they're flicking the discs to try and knock. Yeah, it up. looks like they don't know how to play checkers. And yeah, and yeah. there's like pool uh, pockets in the corners. Yeah, of the and they're really? sliding into the pockets. And then when there's a, a, they're nasty, dude. And they hit the cigar shots and everyone freaks out. There's you know a finger talks? pool. Yeah. <laughs> I keep trying to sh I keep trying to show that to people at like parties and stuff like that, and they just don't get it. No, I can't find it because I refuse. I not that I refuse. I've failed to learn the name of the sport, so I just have to go. Hold on, I forget what it's called, and then I have to Google, uh, like Arab guy slide puck game. Yeah, and then I go. Hold it's on, that's not look. it. <laughs> and then they're standing there for like seriously seven minutes. I'm like, hold on a second. I think this is it. Oh, there's an ad. <laughs> <laughs> hold on. No, this is no, it's not it. Well, I'll show you later when I find it. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, I'll come, I'll come back to you. Down. Yeah, <laughs> let me go with three beers and a blunt. <laughs> That's all. Yeah, like they're all the retarded guys I follow. Like this guy, I can't follow them because then I'll just stare at it all day, like all fucking day. Mm -hmm. And then by the time I try to show it to my girlfriend, she's either sleeping or the baby's pissed, and then it's ruined for me. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I I try to get MJ into some of my stuff. I like a lot of Japanese um, artisan stuff. I like um like what like guys that like make joinery? like uh, like brushes. Yeah, guys that do like very uh, accurate joinery by hand. You Joinery's know, tight. No power tools. Have you seen the Italian kid who tries to be hot while he does masonry? That kid's crazy. We watched, we watched a very sexy pastry chef the other day. Oh, the guy who like licks it and smacks it. I'm yeah, not he into sucks all that crap like and stuff, and we were just kind of grossed out. It's like those guys. What's the, me. Who's the? Wait, I don't. I don't know what his who's name the is. Sexy drywall guy. No, he does marble. He does like stonework. He's a wop, and he's hot. Young. He's got good quaffed hair. He does all of his shit shirtless, but this guy freehand, unbelievable. <laughs> like carve a fucking gargoyle out of stone. Oh, I have seen a dude. You know what I'm talking about posting up with the chisel yeah. on the thing, dude. He's yeah, nasty. I don't know how to find him. But I'm like, you know? brother, your wrists are gonna be killing you. Viral masonry guy, maybe? It'll come up. This guy does I, masonry. Mm, nah, this guy no does masonry blocks. in an old an old fashioned way. This motherfucker does like granite and shit by hand. It's crazy. There's this uh autistic nonverbal kid on Instagram that I was following for a while who would draw pictures with like these crowns or pastels and he's like really ripping it really hard and it, it looks like it looks nonsense. So good. It's nuts, dude. It's so good. And he just like it, you, he pieces together all these different colors, and you're like, "What's this kid doing?" And then it's sick. It works out. Yeah, I had to unfollow him though, because his mom was really like, uh... "Hot." <laughs> oh, this is like him. marketing That's his him? shit. Yeah, I've seen him. this guy. This yeah. kid's nasty, dude. Yep. <clears throat> dude, AI is gonna take your job, dude. They're gonna three D print no churches way. now. No way. No uh, way. This will be the only job they can't take. They say that the greats, they say the true greats really fucking show you their soul <laughs> in the marble. And it's like uh, the, the machines don't have a soul. He's unbelievable. Look at that. That makes me fucking hard. It's so good. Fuck that thing. It's fucking nuts. I like to be a good stone mason. There's no good masons anymore. They're all Mexican. They that look pretty like, tedious, though. Slowly chipping away. Dude, that takes forever. I Very quickly, I'd be like, I'm going to find something to get bigger chunks out of this thing. And then I would and ruin, ruin it. it. Like, <laughs> like right, that was well, $6,000. I don't want to, yeah, I don't want to, I don't want to start a new one tonight. So I'll give it another try tomorrow. And then I just <laughs> give up. Yeah. I'm going to go eat some fucking gabagool. I'll be back tomorrow. Yeah. Slice some fucking yeah. ramon. Yeah, they don't have, there's not as many Italians on fucking construction sites anymore. No. They fell off. Yeah, they all retired. They all moved out to uh, you know Hackensack. You know, True. they're in Jersey. Yeah, nice pizza ovens. They had. They did their time as a as a race. Italian people did their low cost Slave manual time. labor, yeah. and now they just want to fucking hang out in the driveway. <sighs> I respect it. Man. You got a driveway? Yeah, not like a great one. I need to get some driveway going. I need some grass. Mm -hmm. I'm sick of leaf blowing my sidewalk. It doesn't hit the same. It's all cigarettes and needles and shit. You use a leaf blower. You don't just take a push broom and put everything in the gutter. I got a fucking twenty volt Milwaukee leaf blower, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm cooking turtle setting, rabbit setting, whatever you need. Yeah, I don't. I can't. I I, I'm, I can never live in the neighborhood again, man. No, being, being jammed in with people like that. Yeah, really I'm sick of it already. My neighbors are fucking fiends. And then the parking situation. Oh my god, the park. And I hate to be the guy that complains about parking situations, but like, hey, guess Listen, what? Don't get me started on ninety five being shut down. Oh, that what was that three days, two days. Yeah. Well, oh my to my God. girlfriend, it was fucking five years. I seriously, like, I, I like to think I'm a pretty even-keeled guy, but if you shut down one direction of a major highway for over. more than one day, I honestly think about killing the mayor. I mean... I think, I honestly, my, my family would be proud of me if I murdered the mayor of this city. How would you kill the mayor? It's a pretty <laughs> old black lady now, so you could kind of fucking handle yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> handle it. 
By yeah, hand? If you show her a scary enough movie, <laughs> she'll run out of the room. Jump right out her skin, man. <laughs> yeah. Best, yeah. best yeah. of Chris Angel. <laughs> uh, come to the top of William. Is Chris Angel me. still cooking? I, th- I haven't seen I, shit about Danny. Him. Yeah. 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 You're on him? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, he's crushing it, dude. He has the Vegas residency. <sighs> he's yeah. got to be a vicious cokehead or something, right? Oh, I can't he, believe you can have a Vegas like the, residency and not be an animal. Is he kind of like the... He's Dane a family man magic? now. Oh, really? Yeah, he's got a little son. Does he, he still do like the leather shirtless? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, do they call, yeah does yeah, he call yeah. them his brood and shit like that? I can see you know, Drink out of fucking goblets or whatever. Yeah, he keeps it pretty spooky. I wish I could have been a spooky guy. Those guys are nice. Like theme Some parks, eyeliner theme guy. Theme park spooky. Yeah. That'd be so cool. Imagine how exciting... Well, I guess it's mostly children that are excited. Adults are kind of just like, oh my god, man! I hope he doesn't talk to me about what creep guys. Oh. Yeah, you, yeah, you're just kicking around and like really blowing children's minds because it's like, whoa, dude. Yeah, is that a demon? Yeah. I would pie face a magician if they came out. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, dude! I don't remember the last time I've been to. I don't know why I'm thinking about Six Flags now. Magician. I think you said surprising children. I'm like amusement park. Mm-hmm. Have you done Have you done that shit with your kids? Like bring them to roller coasters and shit. Yeah, we go to Hershey Park a lot. <sighs> I haven't been to Hershey in forever. Oh, you got it. Hershey go, rules. Man. It's, it's good. I've yeah. been there since like high school. I think. Oh man, it's a really beautiful place, and some of the roller coasters actually sort of rip. They're nice. Oh, pretty scary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and our our my uh, my my best friend's daughter. Uh, got her finger stuck in a ride, and they got us a bunch of fast passes. No yeah. way! Yeah, the gate closed. Small on her price to pay. Honestly, dude, if it was my finger, I'm saying no deal. But it happened to her, and we got a bunch of fast passes, so we got to ride some roller coasters that you really would have had to wait for. So worth it. Shout out Quinn, thank you. So what much. kind of finger are we talking, Pinky? I think it might have been. It might have been index, and I'm telling you, dude. It Women don't like, like grip strength anyway. Yo, it it's honestly like, looked like someone, a child, started peeling a shrimp. Ah. <sighs> It was the worst ever. Really? Yeah. My so knowing how bad it was, if they said, hey, whoa, whoa, we have to go back. We have to do that again. Someone has to get their finger stuck. It was really bad. Can an adult and step you up? Tribute? <laughs> and they said, Tim, would you mind getting your finger ripped so that we can get those fast passes back? I'd be like, I'm sorry, man. I'll, Can't swing it. No I, deal. That's not the universe I'm going to live in, man. I'm going to live in the one where I look at that roller coaster and think that would have been fun. That would have been tight. Yeah. One ride's enough. So Stop. fucking nasty, dude. I remember when I was in like ninth grade, my buddy's family brought us down to the beach. They got a beach house for the week, and we were leaving. She had just picked me up. We stopped to get McDonald's for the road, and she slammed my hand in her car door. And I didn't say a fucking word for like 20 minutes. My my hand was still in the door because she just had fake tits. So I was like, I'm not upsetting this lady. Jesus Christ. I held it in for so long. And when I said it, I was like, I was like, my hand's in the door, by the way. Did they put any ketchup in the bag? I seriously was like, I'm not going to fucking I'm look so- like a bitch right now. Not with these fucking amazing tits. Shout out Joe's mom, dude. She was so hot. When you got out, was it like big and oh, flat dude, was, and like dude, throbbing she, it, red? It was just white. <laughs> like it had been in there for so long. It was like it was ready to fucking. Dude, Jesus Christ. Man, she was, dude, if you would have seen these titties and you were like 13, it was it was not even up for discussion. You could have got a hug, though, probably. Oh, I got the hug, mm, brother. Yeah, afterwards. The hug was coming oh anyway. My God. I had to wait until my boner went down. <laughs> uh, we got like 20 minutes on the road. She like spazzed and pulled over. Why didn't you tell me? I was like, oh, you know. I'm just I built, like that. That. I'm just yeah, built like, like that. Like people say, I have a high p- t- pain tolerance. <laughs> like out of yeah. all my boys, like I'm the one that basically does yeah. all the, like the craziest stuff. So it's like I, you know, I probably she was unbelievable. This. I was like, I was just watching your tits bounce when you pull out of the parking lot. To be honest, you hit two curves. <laughs> <laughs> it was fucking so pumped. You flooded my brain with endorphins. Oh my god, it was crazy. Wow. Yeah, I forgot about that. It's a good time. Yeah. Are you a beach? Do you do the beach every summer with the kids? Yeah, do you like we bring them, force them to go? Cause don't you have a couple like older it. ones? Yeah, 16, 16 Are they 15, getting pissy 15. on you? Staying cool, getting yeah, there. Yeah, it's kind. Of, it's never predictable, you know. Yeah, hormones. Yeah, and sometimes you know they zig when you think they're gonna zag, and and they're yeah. uh you know stubborn, pain in the fucking dick, and they won't listen to you. But like for the most part, you know. It's pretty working out. We're chilling. <laughs> That's what, dude. I texted my parents the other week. I'm like, how the fuck did you guys do this with four kids? <laughs> like they had four. Every we're all like the old. I'm the oldest, and I'm five years older than the fourth. Like my youngest sibling. So I'm like, what the fuck? Whoa, you're the oldest, and yeah. the youngest is four years younger than you. My youngest sibling's thirty. Yeah. And there's wait, how many? There's like five, four. Four. Me. My. So little, they had my brothers. Two years in a week. Four and five years. Yeah, it's crazy. Dude, my Uncle I Bob mean, got fucking eight 
Talk like, about a fucking diamond uterus. Yeah, I'm like, dude, what are you doing? That's crazy. She did the ultra marathon. Yeah, <laughs> with two different guys. <laughs> so I'm like, Whoa. <laughs> tighten up, dude. Damn. Damn. Whoa. It's pretty nuts. I'm like, how the fuck did you do that? Because you have three kids, right? Yeah. How and how? So first two are about two years apart. Yeah. And and then then your youngest is like you, the youngest. He's like a little boy. Yeah. Yeah. He's like seven years younger. That's cool. The older ones can show him the path. Then. Yeah, they torture him. They yeah. get so frustrated with him because he's so useless, but he wants to try. Yeah. And he has so many questions, and sometimes they just don't want to be bothered, and I have to remind them. But other than that, man, yeah. he's beautiful. Like chill. He's a little <laughs> guy. That's what I just used to think. My, my, little, my autistic sister and my youngest sister, I used to make them fight in the trampoline. <laughs> We lock that trampoline up and like let's go. I I mean I don't I don't make them go <laughs> hand to hand, but I do go. I'm not sorting this out. You guys got to figure it out. I don't care if you argue. Yeah. Get out of my face, dude. Please, I'm trying to play Final Have Fantasy VII. Have <laughs> I'm trying to play Final Fantasy VII. I just got to the beach, dude. They're finally wearing bikinis. Would you guys please go sort this I out I can't for pause it. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I'll it's lose online. the whole game. It's online. I'm, I'm in ranked, so this affects my rank. So <laughs> I feel so I, you if know. it was casual, I would just exit the game. I don't give a fuck, but this is ranked, so please give me a can't lose my ranking, dude. My slot's there. Please. Final Fantasy still going? The, I remember that was going remake. when I was like a kid. Did, they just put out the second part of the remake of Final Fantasy VII. Shit. 1997. Holy fuck. Yeah, it's pretty much the best ever. I've I've been uh, kind of lollygagging in this one section because they go on vacation for a little bit and all the girls put on bikinis. <laughs> and the whole, they keep them on the whole time. You're just kicking around this area. So it's like you crank. every side quest. Yeah. You know, reloading saves. Like I could, I could probably do three stars on that one. Like I could probably do better on I that one. I could do better on yeah. that one. Punch that one up. Yeah. I was a Metal Gear Solid guy when I was a kid. Dude. I like that one with the knocking. And, and you, and I'm sorry, your dad. Yeah. Where is he? Uh, <laughs> Kensington. Chilling, yeah. changing tires. Yeah. Ready for prison. Bro. Chilling. I have a pretty well constructed theory that I think. Uh, Metal Gear Solid was like uh, for a lot of kids. Uh, Snake Plissken was my dad. <laughs> yeah, like that was your last chance at a masculine influence. At, it was either him or Steven Seagal for a lot of dudes. Oh, imagine yeah. if it was Seagal, dude. Imagine if you became a fat martial arts boy. That would have been tight. Metal Gear Solid was like I could do a couple push-ups. Yeah, you know what I mean. I could knock uh, on walls and people would be like, "Where's yeah, that?" Yeah, <laughs> what like, say? yeah. Oh, me against a million guys? Russians? Maybe, I guess, guess. maybe. <laughs> yeah. Until you meet Russians, you're like, "No chance." Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They'd beat the fuck out of yeah, you. See how thick their skulls are? Yeah, this is crazy. Man, yeah, no, Cro-Magnon skull. Good. Yeah, I'm not gonna sneak up behind him. Not happening. I'm not gonna drag him into a locker. You know? Yeah. Maybe metal. Mm. Maybe Snake Plissken was my dad. He wasn't Snake Plissken. Snake Plissken was who he was based on. He oh. was Solid Snake. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's just how Solid Snake. That's how hard I don't remember the. Yeah, I'm not good with that. Do you, do you ever like? I can't remember shit from my childhood. Uh, yeah, I, I have a tough memory time. recall's tough. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, man. Yeah, <laughs> there might be an, uh, a thickened layer of cortisol surrounding yeah. our brains. Keep keep some stuff away from you. Yeah, dude. Don't you let it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I won't deep dive too deep into that. No, but I I vividly remember playing through Metal Gear Solid and the impact. I think I learned about like personal accountability and like even like an honor code. He was our David Goggins. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, this is my guy. This might be him. Yeah. <laughs> We're obsessed with Solid Snake. <laughs> yeah. David Cox. This fucking guy didn't have to ice plunge. You guys are gay. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, you have to smoke cigarettes so you can see the lasers from a security trap. Oh, <laughs> damn, that's why I thought. Damn, I forgot about I, that. I'm, I have dudes paying <laughs> me three thousand dollars for a weekend <laughs> so I can, can I make them get in a cardboard box and oh, have a dog piss on yeah, them. Yeah, you get called a faggot laying get in the down, cold ocean. You fucking pussy. Those dudes. Is that is that true that they're paying eighteen thousand dollars for that? The retreat? Are you, is that what you're talking about? Yeah. The making nights program or something? Something like that. I mean, Fucking. people people pay a lot for online courses, and those are essentially nothing. And these guys are like, what? They're retired Navy SEALs, and you just go down. I don't even know they're Navy SEALs. I think they would just like watch the most YouTube videos about that shit. True. That's you how did they TRT hang. and jiu-jitsu for five years. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm Jocko yeah. Willington. <laughs> this is me. Look at the size of my yeah. There's so many fitted hat, roid, bald guys now. That it's just saturated. Yeah, and they could be in the basement fucking spinning records for the yeah, boys. You could be chilling doing handstands in England and fucking hang gliding, but you chose the dark route, dude. Damn. Go to the light. Fucking white Tarzan. Damn. Or well, silverback Tarzan, whatever the fuck. Danny's giving me the high sign. I think we have to take a break. Me, damn it. We have to take a break and then go over to uh, the Patreon. It's patreon.com slash Tim Butter. Yeah. We're going we're gonna to keep having a blast over there. I mean, is, is it getting late? This is sick. We're, we're entering sleepover hours. 
dun dun dun. Get the soda, dude. Oh yeah, dude, crack a super soda, dude. We're <laughs> I'm gonna delirious. piss on somebody's rug. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ryan Foster, please d- tell them where to find you, where to find me, and what to um, do with you. I'm at Helium every Thursday night, 10 p.m. for Nightcap with Brian Fennell and Courtney Reynolds. I'm Ryan L. Foster underscore on Instagram, and then I do Foster Care podcast in my work van when I feel like it. Daddy's been busy lately, so. Is what it is, but I'll start cranking them out. Oh yeah, spitting on Uber drivers. That's my move. <laughs> Done a lot of that lately. Yeah, that'd be great merch. <laughs> Just loogies on a loogie landing <laughs> on an Uber windshield. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's it. Hell Thanks yeah. for having me. Oh yeah, uh, Noah, where are we at? What are we looking at? We're looking pretty good. Whoa, tough. Wow. I mean, he is. Is that after he r- rammed his face into the ground? Hang yeah. yeah. Oh God, it's horrific. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm, uh, there's gonna be more detail. And stuff, yeah, but you know, you do the booger scar. Yeah, probably. Hit him with the bug. <laughs> yeah. if, I was thinking either 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 booger scar or like fresh just got out just got out the accident. Yeah. Oh yeah. He's still he's still connected to the hang glider. Fresh That's yeah. what's behind him. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I thought he was in a honeycomb or something. <laughs> <laughs> honeycomb. Shit. All right, <laughs> we'll see you guys over there. Let's Thank do you. It. Oh wait, come see me at Soul Joel's May eighteenth. Let's Pottstown, go. Pennsylvania. Motherfucking Soul